Unit 80 is a wildly popular hunting destination. The Rio Grande National Forest, located in the western portion of the unit, remains a choice location for resident and non-resident hunters alike. Stay well informed on Unit 80 hunting news by visiting one of the four government offices that are located within the unit. A U.S. Forest Office and BLM Field Office are located in Del Norte. Monte Vista contains other U.S. Forest Office and CPW Office. When planning your hunting trip to Colorado Unit 80, it should also be noted that hunting is prohibited in the Great Sand Dunes National Park and the Monte Vista National Wildlife Refuge and the Baca National Wildlife Refuge. The versatility of the topography in Unit 80 makes for an adventurous and exciting mule deer hunt. Unit 80 is predominantly public land, mainly concentrated on the western side of the unit, and eastern side of the unit is mainly private land. That being said, hunters are encouraged to come equipped with a GPS unit with a landowner chip so that you do not infringe on private property. The deer tend to retreat to the private land once hunting pressure increases, and hunting these boundaries has proven to be successful. Mule deer quality in this unit averages anywhere from 145 to 165, with the occasional 175 buck. The current buck to doe ratio is 28 to 100. Unit 80 has substantial hunting pressure due to its OTC elk tags and success rate. As the elk feel pressured, they will retreat to the tougher terrain and hard to reach areas. Hunters that take on the challenge to go where the elk go have been successful. The average quality of elk in Unit 80 varies anywhere between two 60 to 300. The current bull to cow ratio is 18 to 100. Unit 80 provides an antelope's perfect habitat with its vast tracts of grassy prairie land and ample water supply. The average quality is 70 inches to 80 inches and the buck to doe ratio is 32 to 100. The terrain of Colorado Unit 80 ranges from low elevation grasslands to snow-capped mountain ranges. Creeks and streams carve their way into the countryside and ponds surrounded by rocks and mountain peaks are poised throughout the high country. There are vast expanses of shrub-covered hills and the grass Ground material varies from rocky to lush soil that breathes life into this very green landscape. The coniferous forest full of spruces, firs, and pines that forest the mountains join with the sagebrush-covered hills in the valleys that paint the countryside. Riparian vegetation such as cottonwoods and willows line the creeks and streams. U.S. Route 160 binds 180 on the northern border and follows along the western boundary. U.S. Highway 285 runs vertically on the eastern side of the unit and connects with U.S. Route 160 in the north. Various national forest roads navigate throughout the unit with country roads. There are 105 miles of trails with nine trailheads located located among Unit 80. Be mindful of what areas allow motorized vehicles and which areas do not since the majority of public land in Unit 80 is a national forest.